What is up, people? We are back at it with another zone speculation video, and this time we are diving straight into the fire with one of the smaller but more interesting zones, the volcanic region. volcanic region, one of the most western zones in Vera and home to a few volcanoes and lava. There is no starting zone in it, but it does have two potential node sites and is near the Riverlands, which is a human zone and probably means you'll see a lot of human architecture here if you see much architecture. With these two node sites, that means you could build a city up right in the region of the volcano, which would be a pretty badass looking node. Although we haven't actually seen any of this before, and we don't know how much is going to influence a node. It sounds like it will a little bit at least, so you could see some pretty cool looking architecture in this node if your server decided to level it up. This zone is one that is most intriguing to me as it sounds as though it will be impacted by the weather system a lot. To be honest, I don't even know if this zone exists in its entirety at the beginning of a server's life or if it's a zone that comes together from player progression. If you take a look at the map, the volcanic region does exist exist, so it's somewhat present physically, but I wouldn't be surprised if these volcanoes are dormant at the beginning of a server's life. From the beginning of Ashes, there have been talks of volcanoes erupting and reshaping parts of the world and unlocking dragon raid bosses, and we even have some concept art of lava flowing through what appears to be a jungle forest, which the volcanic region is just on the outskirts of the jungle, so this very well could be a zone that is filled with dormant volcanoes and expands as the erupt from player interaction. And then there's also this one, which I assume is the edge of the Riverlands, showing the volcanic region kind of coming towards it. Could be completely wrong on this though, we will have to wait until probably Alpha 2 to see, as I imagine we're going to get the volcanic region in Alpha 2, as it's one that has been shown heavily in live streams in the past. Anyways, you can expect this area to be filled with large rocky environments, rivers of lava, and smoke filling the air and blocking out the majority of the sun as this zone burns away everything it can. There appear to be smaller volcanic spouts in some areas as well, along with giant cave systems that could house some interesting foes to fight. In some concept art, you can see these large lava-infused golem-looking guys going up against some players, along with a dragon breathing fire in the background. We did see two fire dragons in Alpha 1, which could potentially be making their home in the volcanic region in the final version of the game. One of them was the Pyroclastic Worm, which this guy lived under a mountain in a dungeon where you'd have to fight through a bunch of fire bears as well as some raptors and other creatures to get to him. And then there was the Elder Dragon in Siege that was surrounded by a small volcanic-like area, so I feel as though it's a pretty safe bet to say that you will run into these guys in this zone. The Pyroclastic Worm, I am convinced, is the dragon that can be awoken from the mountain in the Node 1 video as well. They look pretty similar, and this is something that has been talked about for ages. I imagine you'd see the Fox of the Pyre, the Embered Kid, and the Cinderhorn Steer all reside in this area as well, as they are all fire-based creatures, but this is just speculation. What are you hoping to see in the volcanic region in Ashes of Creation? Let me know in the comments down below, and if you're new to ashes and have yet to create an account feel free to do so using my referral link in the description and comments below otherwise be sure to click that subscribe button hit that thumbs up turn on the bell for notifications and stay tuned for a lot more to come